Good evening, everybody. I just have a very quick update for you. It's for February 29th, 2012. Today, uh, or the, I should say this morning, when the uh, when the market was pushing to the upside, our delta on this started getting a little high. Right now, this T plus zero line is wacky. But um, you know, when the market was open and we were here in this position, it's showing us a minus six delta, but it was really minus about minus 14. Uh, that was getting a little uncomfortable for me in this particular trade. And since I was going to be gone the rest of the day, I decided to come in here and buy some uh, some more upside protection. Now, normally, I might be looking at something like taking this 800 Russell vertical and rolling it out to 810, taking this short and rolling it out to 810. But if I was to do that, the adjustment would have been too severe. It would have put me on uh, a pretty much neutral delta. So... I had to do uh, an alternative since this position is so small. And what I did is I went into the IWM and I bought three IWM 8081 calls. And that cut my delta down uh, to about minus seven, which is uh, which which was acceptable. Now, uh, of course, the market uh, didn't stay up here very long. It pulled back. And I kind of expected it to pull back. This is where we currently stand. We're up about 466, which is very close to our uh, to our profit target. Although, as I said, this line is kind of wacky, so I'll have to take a look at this in the morning and see where where we are really at, uh, and go from there. But that is the uh, March M3 position. The April M3 position has yet to be entered, so we don't have that going on. And while we're here, we'll just take a quick look at the bearish butterfly. Okay, so here is the April bearish butterfly. We only got one third in. I was kind of hoping uh, we would get a, a further up move to get scaled in a little more, but uh, we, that move may still yet come. We don't know. Anyway, if it doesn't come, I'm perfectly happy right now to sit here in one third position and collect as much money as I can. If we get a, uh, you know, obviously we don't have a problem unless the market gets down under 760, uh, which is very unlikely. And if we hang out here, that'll be good for us. Um, and if we get that move, we can still scale it. And so all is good. It's up a couple hundred dollars. The profit target on this particular trade, I started with on one lot this month uh, for the for the website trade. No particular reason. It's just um, I like to trade it in the smallest increment as possible on the examples, so that if anybody's following, I don't I don't want to encourage people trading too largely. So this is going to have a maximum loss of uh, $1,500 or a, uh, a profit target of $1,500. And uh, yeah, we'll see how the month goes and see if we can do that this month. And uh, okay, so that's it for now. I will keep you updated with any other position moves and I'll put something together uh, for a market update for you for our next week. All right, have a great weekend, everybody. Bye.